Hey guys, welcome to the channel Market Uncharted. Today we are going to think about a strategy and how to invest following our strategy and some key factors that we must pay attention to when investing in the real world and any financial uh, product. So great investors have different strategies but similar approaches. Let's learn from the greats to see how we can become better investors. So first one, do your research. Research is perhaps the most crucial part to being a good investor. You shouldn't invest in a company that you don't understand. It's important to know how a company works before you put your money on the line. So from Warren Buffett looks at two key pieces of a company, quality and price. According to Buffett, if a company isn't a quality company, don't buy it, even if the price is low. Low quality companies produce low quality results. Take away, be picky, only invest in the companies that you believe are high quality and have something to offer. Have conviction, trust yourself as an investor is crucial to being successful. Bill Gross, the founder of PIMCO, found success by trusting himself and taking risks. Diversification is, is of a portfolio is important when investing. However, after doing proper research, if you believe you have found a true winner, don't be afraid to invest a little extra. Taking a chance and adding a little more risk to your portfolio could result in a big payday. Takeaway, don't hesitate to take a risk after doing exhaust, exhaustive research. Trust yourself as an investor. Be patient. From the Prince Bin Talal, a Saudi Arabian investor grew his wealth by being patient. He was an early investor in Citigroup and held through rocky markets, resulting in huge gains. Holding and buying more of an asset when it's undervalued will likely result in large gains in the long run. Trust your research and invest in companies that you believe in. When the market is down, don't panic. Use a dip in the market as an opportunity to buy your favorite companies at a discount price. Be wary. When investing, everyone thinks they have found the next big stock. Whether it's friends, family or someone online, be careful when taking investment advice. Investor Carl Icahn once said, you learn in this business, if you want a friend, get a dog. Do your own due diligence before making an investment. It's fine to take investment advice from others. It's actually beneficial at times. However, make sure to do your own research before you decide to invest in a recommended stock. Invest in the future. The world is always changing in new and innovative ideas being created every day. Investor Carlos Slim has used this to become one of the richest men in the world. Slim made his fortune by finding new trends before they blew up. He studied the momentum of companies and how they compared to their competition. Invest now for what will happen later. Become a forward thinker and identify companies that will make an impact in the future. Let winners win. Dennis Gartman is an investor that preaches the trait of not selling too early. He follows two rules. Let your winners run and don't let your loss get away. If you cut your losses early and don't sell at the first sign of profit, your profits will likely outweigh your losses even if you lose more often. Invest in a company until a reason you invested no longer exists. Don't sell a stock just because you're worried about losing short-term gains. And this is something extra uh, important from the, the environment nowadays. We are definitely in a bubble. So Ray Dalio just put six measures to identify bubbles in any financial um, product. Number one, how high are prices relative to their traditional measures? Number two, are prices discounting unsustainable conditions? Number three, how many new buyers have entered the market? Number four, how broadly bullish is the sentiment? Five, are purchases being financed by high leverage, which means low interest rates makes people take a leverage to make these investments. Number six, have buyers made exceptionally extended forward purchase to speculate or protect themselves against future price gains? This is something that you should always ask yourself before making any investment. 
So thank you so much guys for watching the video. Don't forget knowledge is not power, knowledge is potential power, execution is everything. Always do your own due diligence, your own research before investing in any financial asset. And don't forget, just like the markets, we will not rest.